All right, everybody. Welcome back to the Driveway Engineer. I'm gonna do a real quick video. We're gonna test the uh, acceleration here. It's a topic that came up today. Um, how fast is something's pretty subjective, right? I mean, it just really loudly depends on what you think is fast. So, hopefully you can see my speedometer there. Typically when I put the video up there, you can. I have a GPS speedometer here. Um, and I'm going to use the Gaia GPS. This is what I use when I go off-roading. Um, I'm gonna start recording a track. And I'm gonna switch back to the Ulysses speedometer. It just worked out that my speedometer happens to be perfectly accurate. So this was a 22RE Auto with 430 gears um, and now it has 32s and a 5-speed and the same 430 gears and it just so happens to be like a happy accident that the speedometer is perfect. But I'm going to leave that up there so you guys can see it for yourselves. And I just heard every cop in town take off the other side of town. So, a great time for this kind of shenanigans. I got a fairly straight run over here towards my nephew's house. Right up there where that ramp's going, actually. So I'm just going to run it up to 60, 65 ish. over whether or not this would be fast enough and it totally is um, I can run freeway speed I've actually pulled my 1600 pound trailer around a little bit uh, like this is this is good as a, a six-cylinder TJ which I haven't had in quite a while but I have had before I'm gonna give her hell and smoke this minivan out
1800 it takes off. There was a lot of smoke on the tailpipe. You know, a lot of drama below 1800. But it works, it goes. guys I'm going to uh, go edit this and throw all the data together for you and uh, thanks for watching hope this helps hope you enjoyed it even if you don't want an OM617 but if you think you might I hope this helps you out because whether or not it was going to be way slow was a real concern of mine or, and again mine's a 7.5 millimeter pump with an HE221 turbo so thanks guys